various activities that are scheduled from the DFC's perspective towards the, um, the, the, the performances that will be on, not only for the footy Carnival but for the other events that we have aligned. So, Mr. Diggins. Thank you very much, Mr. Cuffey. Good morning, all. Special good morning to all. Uh, good, good afternoon, actually, to members of the, of the press and to the listening public out there. It is always good to be here to, be, to identify ourselves with the activities of the, the, the DFC. As a matter of fact, every time, every year I come here, I feel a special joy because here is the National Bank identifying with all the, the, the preeminent cultural festival, not only in Dominica, but in the region. But this year is a, a particularly pleased to introduce a true son of the soil to the Republic. This is Susan Joseph Piper, who, who only this month came on board as our marketing and, and um, community relations executive. It is particularly pleasing for me to introduce Mrs. Joseph Piper, not only because she is a true son of the soil, but she is also a, a professional marketing person. Some of you would remember her as playing a major role in the telecommunications business, not only in Dominica, but throughout the Caribbean. Um, she, she just returned from the United States where she worked with General Electric, commercial finance of the Minnesota, um, um, Minnesota. And when we asked her why does she want to return to Dominica, she says she would like to be able to contribute to the economic development of Dominica. And we understood why she chose working with National Bank, because we are the leaders in contributing to the national development of Dominica, certainly in the financial sector, together, of course, with our, our brothers and sisters in the credit union. Without any further ado, I want to hand you over to Mrs. Joseph Piper, who will, have, will be reading a, a press release from <coughs> National Bank as to exactly what we'll be doing this year at, at the festival. I am pleased to be associated with the National Bank of Dominica, Dominica's bank. Um, the NBD is one of the more innovative <coughs> banks within the region. And so I look forward to working in that dynamic environment with Mr. DeGans and his team. But I'm here for on a second mission, I'm here to announce our involvement in the World Career Music Festival this year. And I have a statement here from the National Bank of Dominica that I will deliver to you. National Bank of Dominica Limited announced last month the intention to participate in a bigger way in this year's World Career Music Festival. And after careful consideration and with, in partnership with the DFC, the NBD has decided to sponsor the Creole Village Line. This is a new event which is scheduled for October 2nd, 9th, and 16th on the Dame Eugenia Charles Boulevard in Roseau, commonly known as the Bay of Roseau. In this regard, the Creole Guadalame event, which in previous years was sponsored and organized by the NBD, will be taken over by the Rosa City Council this year. Over the last four years, the NBD has sponsored Queo Guadalame, and a dedicated group of NBD staff work tirelessly together with the Rosa City Council to make Queo Guadalame a much appreciated event to the World Creole Music Festival. We are satisfied that this event is now one of the much looked forward to events during the Creole Festival season that comes alive each October. And as such, we have turned it over to the Rosa City Council, who will be organizing the event this year. We are looking forward to supporting a new venture, the Creole Village Line, and in so doing, we are assisting the DFC in its efforts to broaden the scope of the World Creole Music Festival and to tie in more closely the cultural events of the season. Creole Village Line will showcase artists of Creole music and other art forms and will provide a festival that is um, 
a festive environment that is re also relaxing. We are hoping that during the Creole season, Dominicans and visitors will make it their Friday night line with music, entertainment, food, and of course, good company. Our overall goal is to support the enhancement and the growth of the festival to become a world-class event for both locals and visitors. We look forward to participating in this year's World Career Music Festival activities in a new and different way and appeal to everyone to come out and enjoy. Thank you, Mrs. Joseph Bagwell.